The roar of engines approaching the gate is exactly what you'd expect at SeaTac Airport. As the main engines wind down, something new is happening. This yellow hose will get hooked up underneath the aircraft to bring into the cabin preconditioned air. Preconditioned air reduces about 40,000 metric tons of greenhouse gases per year, which is the equivalent of taking about eight, over 8,000 cars off the road. Without preconditioned air, the aircraft's auxiliary engine runs the heating and cooling inside the plane, burning fuel as it sits at the gate. PC Air will save airlines about 5 million gallons of fuel each year, or about $15 million. It reduces our greenhouse gas emissions. It also reduces the amount of time that the airplanes are idling at the gate. This reduces pollution in and around the airport. It also saves the airlines money because they don't have to spend all that money on fuel. The Port of Seattle built a centralized plant underneath the terminal to precondition the air for all of its gates. This dramatically boosts the Century Agenda goal to be the greenest and most energy efficient port in North America. And then we pump it around through the airport out to all the different concourses that gets delivered to the aircraft and then it either provides cooling uh, during the summer months or in the winter months we provide heating to the aircraft. The $43 million project has been offset by nearly $22 million in federal grants. With the current cost of fuel, the project is expected to pay off for the airlines in less than three years. Preconditioned air is a great example of a win-win project where we can put in infrastructure that helps the airlines turn off those engines, reduce that pollution and save that fuel.